When you need an efficient, economical, temporary storage solution, you can't top Brant grain bag loaders and unloaders. These reliable units make the job a breeze. To fill the bag, first load the empty bag onto the tunnel using the bag loading cradle and raise the bag pan into place while ensuring that the pan is level. Be sure to remove slack from the bag using the tie straps and cut off the white tie straps from the bag. Pull the bag out a few feet and loosely position the bungee cord behind the folded bag. Now, pull out 10 to 13 feet of bag and fold in the outer edges. Seal the edges using two 12-foot long 2x4s with 3-inch deck screws and roll twice underneath. Then place them 3 feet back under the bag and fully tighten the bungee cord. Now, it's time to load the bag. With your grain cart in position, start your tractor, leaving it in neutral with brakes off and engage the PTO. As the bag fills, you control its shape using brake pressure, monitored with a pressure gauge. On some models, you can even adjust the bag pan height on the fly to fine-tune performance and keep the bag filling just the way you want it. As the bag reaches capacity, simply release the brakes to stop filling the bag and remove the unit. Then, seal the bag in the same fashion as the other end with two 2x4s. When it's time to unload the bag, locate your Brant grain bag unloader at the end of the loaded bag and switch from transport to field position. Now, engage the bag knife, raise the unload auger, lower the cross auger and open the bag. Then, connect the filled bag to the roller. Engage the drive and unload the bag into your grain cart or semi-trailer unit. When you reach the end of the bag, simply disengage the bag roller clutch. Unroll the bag, store the bag knife and return the unit to transport position. Temporary crop storage does not have to be a hassle. For efficient and economical operation, you can't top Brant grain bag loaders and unloaders.